Mrs. Burns. Let me explain. Our stomachs produce acid to digest our food. This acid is usually kept inside your stomach by a sphincter muscle at the base of your food pipe and by your diaphragm muscle at the base of your chest. Some lifestyle factors cause our stomachs to produce too much acid. For example, coffee, spicy food, anti-inflammatory pills, oily food, alcohol, stress, smoking. When our stomach acid gets too much, one, gastritis. This feels like tummy pain under the ribs. Oh. Gastritis also causes persistent nausea. <laughs> 2. Acid reflux. This often feels like heartburn. Oh. Oh. 3. Trapped wind can cause bloating and burping. Uh. Four, acid fumes waft up to the back of the throat. This can cause hoarse voice, bad breath, hiccups, persistent cough, metallic taste. Although these are the common risk factors, this problem is also more likely if you are pregnant, obese, or if you have a hiatus hernia. These symptoms, related to stomach acid, are referred to as gastroesophageal reflux. If removing the underlying lifestyle cause doesn't help or isn't possible, then medication may be needed. Like antacids, which neutralize the stomach acid for temporary relief or stomach tablets block acid production so that the damage to the stomach lining can heal If high strength stomach tablets are not helping, your doctor may test you for H. pylori. <laughs> this bug enters through your mouth. 
<laughs> then when in your stomach, it causes <laughs> excess acid production. <laughs> and then gastritis. <laughs> if you have any worrying, alarm, symptoms, your doctor will arrange further tests. One of our agents will be with you as soon as possible. You are number 327 in the call queue. Your call is important to us. One of our agents will be with you as soon as possible.